All right, gonna do some bomber hunting this round. Again, some altitude first. I'm not gonna cut this video. All right, it's pretty about. awesome. Gonna so I'm gonna gain altitude, I gain some speed, and uh, certain planes seem to gain altitude at different angles. So this one can cut a pretty hard angle and still not lose speed so fast. I'm gonna get up to about 300 kilometers an hour, I'll level back off, gain my speed back up, and then I'll go for a second climb. Trying to keep an eye on the fighters, make sure no one gets in range. It's like I'm pretty good here. And I'm watching during my climb, because nothing sucks worse than getting shot where you're going slow. Destroy the target! So it doesn't look like anybody's going for me. The year two is coming in fast. I don't know what's wrong with him, but he thinks he's coming through me. And yeah, not so much. Down he goes. So I got a Spitfire and a Wellington here. I'm worried about that Spitfire. And an IL-4 is just right there. So I take him. I'm worried about that Spitfire. As I roll around on this Wellington, finish this IL-4 off. He's done. All right, so the Wellington's almost in range. Looking for that Spitfire. He's up there, and the Wellington's gone. Unbelievable. Gain my altitude back. Keeping my eyes peeled. Normally you get 190s that'll dive bomb on you when you're up fighting hunters, but I don't know this round, I didn't see any 190s up here. And here comes the B-17, I'm going pretty slow. There was really no threats though, so I'm going to hold this. Under 300, am I going to hold it? Yeah, he's screwed. Don't even get shot at. It's pretty awesome shooting down a B-17 without taking any fire. So there's three bombers down. That's going to help us tons. Okay, so that other B-17 shot down my next target. I'm up pretty high. The Spitfire kind of up here with me. There's a B-17 behind me. He's going to try to help this B-17 out, but he doesn't need it. Now I'm rolling back around. I'm going to try to get my altitude back up. Okay, there we go. I'm up higher than the bombers are starting. So I should be able to spot this Wellington. I'm going to freaking dive on him. Smoke for the bombers right now. just out shot the crap out of my B-17 teammate. I mean, that's... I'll go ahead and let yeah, him have it. Yeah, I'm do it Ruined his day. Back up to gaining my altitude. Another B-17. There's a 190 a right there with him. Even if they smoke, they can still drop bombs. So we need to get them, get them shot down. So the 190 looks like he stalled out or something. The B-17's pulling away pretty hard. Getting my speed up, and then when I'm underneath them, I'll come up underneath them. It's it's way better at avoiding the guns, and there's a good chance he doesn't even see me under here. And you know, just about toast. That 190 is probably pretty bummed. It took his kill, but. Gotta get those. Uh, gotta get those bombers out of the sky. The 190 is probably pissed. And I think that's almost 
it for this match. I was gonna go help this B-17 out, but he gets he gets shot up pretty bad. He goes down. I don't want to dive on this Wellington. Way yeah. too high up to go way down to the ground south again. Too. I'll go try to protect our B-17. Probably won't make it in time. Down goes my B-17. Nobody's really in striking range. Thanks. I'm just gonna maintain my speed, get my altitude back up, come back around from way above them. I don't want to give them any advantage. That 190 was coming after me, but I just had way too much speed for him to keep up. Batch is almost done, out of bombers. So I'm gonna go for this Tempest. Can't even see him, just firing blind into the clouds. Yeah, looks like I lined up pretty good. I'm just gonna let him go. Try to get maybe a couple more shots off before the end. I don't think I need more. I'm reloading, reloading! Yay, we won. Let's go home. Yay, we 